finally washed away my past of regret to give you that part of me nothing more that I could taste cause I'm dropping, I'm dropping What will it be tonight, E? Usual, Frank. Scotch on the rocks coming up. Going out tonight? No, not tonight. You know, it wouldn't hurt to have some fun. You should get out of this place. Go meet a girl. Get laid, for God's sakes. I don't need to get laid. How many times do I have to repeat myself? Mother? You and that guitar are inseparable, huh? Hi, Frank. See you tomorrow night? Poor kid. something to drink? Um, yeah, sure. Can I get a beer, please? There you go. Thanks. Um, so what's the story? Who, Elliot? He's been playing here for a few years. Yeah, but I mean, he's really good. I mean, why keep playing here? Now that I can't answer. All the talent in the world, and the kid continues to come here and play for these deadbeats. The night that he doesn't come here, I finally know he's all right. Well, what happened to him? Who's your friend? Sure thing. Elliot, this is... I'm sorry, I didn't get your name. Hi, I'm Abby. Hi. I really love the way you play. You just sound so sincere up there. Thanks, I appreciate it. So how long have you been playing? A few years. You always write your own stuff? Yeah, pretty much. Oh, that's awesome, you know? I mean, for me, music's like an, like an escape. I mean, don't you think it's funny how a couple of different chords on a guitar can either make you laugh or make you cry? I mean, I mean, there's just nothing quite like it. So what are you, some sort of music hit? Me? No. I mean, you know, I've had dreams of being up on stage. You know, not like for money or anything, just... God, I mean... You know, playing the guitar in front of like thousands of people and being immortalized for like that one moment in time. I used to have dreams like yours. Well, what happened to them? Nothing. It's getting pretty late. I gotta get going. Okay. Well, when are you gonna play again? I play about just about every night. 
All right, well then I'll see you tomorrow, I guess. You know, I'm starting to think that you're a little bit more fond of that six string than you are of me. What's not to love about fresh wood and six strings and magic, huh? Hey, can I ask you something? You know that photo on your nightstand? Who is that girl? Is she like, you know, your sister or something? No, it's nothing you need to worry about. Elliot, you know you can trust me. Please just stop, okay? What is it with you? Like, I mean, we've been hitting it off for the past few months, and yet you don't want to tell me anything about your past. Why is it so important you hear about my past? It's not a good one, so could you not bring it up anymore, please? But it's our past that makes us who we are. <sighs> Elliot! Elliot! Talk to me. Stop this bullshit. It's not bullshit. To me it is. Pat, I just, I just want you to know that I'm here for you. I can take care of myself, okay? Can't you just open up to me for once? I mean, how am I supposed to understand you if you won't tell me what happened? She died, okay? My girlfriend of five years. The girl I was hopelessly in love with died in a car accident outside the fucking bar. She was coming to see a gig I had down the street. Slipped out some black eyes, hit a pole, and that was it. I lost the most important thing in my life because of music! I'm so sorry, Elliot. My, my music has caused more bad than good. That's why I play at that bar every night. It's the least I can do for her. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hurt you. I'm, I'm sorry. Just get out of here, okay? Don't do this. Get out of here! Hey, baby. Sorry I haven't been gone in a while. I've been pretty busy with some stuff. I brought you some flowers, though. I met a girl a few weeks ago. I told myself I could never fall in love again. But I think I did. 
I don't know if that's okay or, or not. I just don't want to get hurt again. Music, is it an escape from reality? In some ways, yes. It was a wall that I created to hide behind, to store emotions that I didn't want to have to deal with. It was a way to vacation my mind to somewhere I thought I could be happy again. Problem is, it, it didn't turn out that way. Music washes away from the soul the dust of everyday life, but maybe sometimes, it's better to be caught up in the moment of life, especially the ones where you are presented with something as beautiful as love.